hello guys welcome to the fifth tutorial of flutter mvvm news app and here so far we have done so good in just a short time we have created this app this is looking amazing and also has the latest architecture from the technology that we have for mobile development so right now we have to display the text under here okay so what we can do is we can come out of this uh, come out of this uh, widget of circle image and it should have a footer actually we have to come out here footer so the footer is going to be another container that can have a padding edge inset symmetric horizontally it should have 15 pixels of padding and the text is going to be this dot article title and if I if I refresh the app, reload the app or whatever, we should be seeing the title here. But now it is being, it is being like, you know, displaying above the images. So we need to bring it down. Okay. So we will be doing that. Yeah. So the text is being displayed above on the top of the images. So we have to work with that a little bit. So let's just go and style it a little bit. Style, textile, textile widget that we are going to use. And the font, font weight can be bold. And font size could be 15. So if I reload the app now. Yeah, so the text is still like on the top of the image, but we will be sorting that out. Meanwhile, let's just go and style it a little bit more. The text has to be max one line and should have ellipses also. Ellipses. And what we can do here is we can just, uh, yeah, it is down now. So it is under here. All the text that, that we were seeing above the images have been arranged beautifully. So now what is our next task? Our next task is to bring all this whenever we are clicking, we should be seeing something on the detail also. Okay. That is our next task and this is great this is done and maybe we can check if it is working so if i click on india then the news from india are being loaded here okay and if i click on korea then news from korea should be loading here so this is that you are seeing that we had earlier added the error icon if the image is not available then it should display that and those images for those that are images are available we are not seeing that so that's great so we'll just go back to the usa and now what we need to do is whenever we click on something it should take us to detail screen and then we will be done so let's just work on that so whenever we were clicking on the on the grid item and we were seeing a black screen so we have to work on that right so how do we display the news here so first of all we'll just go scaffold and app bar so whenever you click click on the grid tile it should show the title 
in the app bar it should show the title of the article that you have clicked on so we can just go article and title we don't need to style it and we can just click on hot reload and now if I will click on something so dozens of Hong Kong if I click on coronavirus coronavirus is here if I click on dozens of COVID is here if I click on why crime condition it's showing in here so now let's just work on the body this body and we will return a container the body has a container and we can add padding edge insets only right 20 left 20 and top 20 so let's just create a column because we want to display the image and below it we want to display the text so this is going to be real quick a widget And let's just add in so this container needs to have height of 300 pixel sorry not this one so here in here we can just uh, return uh, another container not return actually add add a container because we have to display the image according to whatever image that has been clicked on that image has to come on so circle image we had already created a stateless widget so we are just going to re-import it and what it takes it takes the string whatever the 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 string url url to image it takes that as a parameter so whatever that we have clicked on would be on this and we can add size box of 5 so maybe I can just show you for now okay, we need one more here show you for now that why did we added okay so if I click on this this is opening up beautifully right whatever the image that you are clicking on is coming up and now what sized box is going to add some space vertically so we can have our title in here center child text this article title and we can style it if we want style text style font weight font weight dot bold and font size we can give it 18 and we can add this error let's just bring it down here and this also needs to have a comma okay, um, so why is it showing us the text yeah center is font size some issue is that why is it expected to find
let's just let's just get rid of this and return text article title and now i can maybe oh yeah the problem was not this the problem was sized box didn't have the comma in here yeah okay it's gone now it should be working for us okay yeah so now if we go back so it should display us the title also okay so lastly we need to display the description and description can also have the size box in the height and we can add another widget here text this article description and if we want to add a little bit styling to it we can add it so right after the description we can add another widget text style font size could be 15 font weight yeah no need font weight and let's just save the app and i think we are done with this app for good so let's just uh, hot restart our app and this error is coming because of because of maybe some article does not have the some article does not have the some text that is why okay so here is some kind of an error that we can fix that why is it giving us that error so flutter so failed search and data is null okay null exception so what we need to do in here is um, maybe check our service file first of all okay and uh, details screen okay news grid and going back to our details screen So let's just take this away. And now try this. If this does not work now, we have to restart this whole thing. Okay, now it's just gone blank. Oh, we don't want that. I'll just pause the video and like delete the app and like reinstall it let's just reinstall the app so our app should be coming up anytime soon let's just see what it displays and uh, yeah it's here and uh, news are being loaded So let's wait for these pictures to be loaded. Sometime it could be the internet. Okay, yeah. So we really have to get rid of this. A strong nail strong must be provided to tax widget. So maybe the description here, description. The spellings in here, maybe I have done mistake or something like that. So maybe we have to go back to our model. 
the script. Yeah, the spelling here is wrong. See the exact thing that I was telling you that make sure the spellings are right description. And if you see this here, in here, if you open this up, when we are the place that we are fetching the response from the spelling, this is the spelling that we need. So earlier the spellings were not correct, then that, that is why our app was crashing. So let's just I have changed it and now let's just save it. And now this error should go away from our eyes forever more. Okay, let's just hot restart it. And we will not see this error. Description. Let's just check the spelling in description. Yeah. Let's just copy this. Yep, you see the description is here. Here. So guys, the app seems to be working excellently fine. If I click on this, so you are seeing no errors in the the error that we were getting, the null exception one, because we had the wrong key passed in. And lastly, I would just change the country, maybe India. So, yep. You are seeing the images are being loaded and you can click and move around. So let's just go to USA, back to it. And yeah, I think guys, this was a success tutorial. And what we can do is uh, I would just upload this into my GitHub repository. All the tutorials, projects, the source code is available for free. All you can do is just subscribe the channel and leave a comment if you liked or disliked the video. It's okay. But obviously, don't click dislike and just click likes. And I need subscribers so, you know, it can encourage me to make more videos like this and help you guys. And also, the way I'm learning so you can learn also lastly i think oh wait just wait i think i didn't display the time in here because we had converted the time and we we can use this because let's make the use of it so let's just go back to the uh, i think not the news grid yeah news grid and like we can display the time also the time that we didn't display oh snap because we had converted it and like i think it deserves to be I think it's in main screen or where not main screen uh, news grid that's the type okay detail yeah in the detail we can display the time so let me just take another uh, right below the image let's add text article no, this article because we had converted the time right so this is going to look really really cool and let's see now the result yeah this is the time that we were like converting so this is the time that is coming here i can style it a little bit so it can look really better yeah this i have had forgotten but now you would be really happy because this is we had converted it and font size can be a little bit 14 font weight can be bold okay so now let's just uh, this is me signing off and i will catch you in the next tutorial with some more videos so please subscribe the channel and let me know if you liked it the source code is available in the description. Be safe. Peace.